Samsung just pulled off something that has Galaxy fans buzzing, not just a beta, but a second beta that quietly fixes some of the most frustrating bugs we've been dealing with for weeks. And that's not even the best part, all the behind. The scenes moves hint that we're just days away from the biggest software drop of the year one UI 8.0 stable. Yeah, it's coming fast, and it might hit your phone way sooner than you think. Welcome back, viewers. JBS here. If you love staying ahead on Samsung news, go ahead and like this video, share it with your tech friends, and subscribe so you don't miss the next big drop. Let's start with the big update that rolled out quietly. One UI 8 Beta 2 is live for the Galaxy S23, S23 8 Live, and S23 Ultra in South Korea, and it fixes three huge annoyances. No more random phone resets, no more DAX settings disappearing when you upgrade, and yes, the Galaxy Watch 7 Clock now updates the weather in real time, just like it should have from day one. And while this update may seem small, the timing is what makes it special. Samsung is clearly polishing every detail before the public release. And speaking of polishing, Samsung's Penup app just got its biggest refresh of the year. A new brush tool, Smooth One UI 8 support, and a 129 MB update that makes drawing on your Galaxy device feel way more natural, even more interesting. Stable One UI 8 is already live on the Galaxy Tab S11 and S11 Ultra. That's a huge sign that the rollout is nearly ready for the rest of us. If you own a Galaxy S25 Ultra or any S Pen powered device, you're on the short list for the stable build next. But here's where it gets even more exciting. Samsung has started pushing a wave of Galaxy Store updates across the board. Apps, system components, and even those hidden language packs that power Galaxy AI translation are all being updated right now. And historically, that only happens right before a major stable release. It's like Samsung is loading every piece of the puzzle so that when the update drops, everything works flawlessly from day one. And yes, we now have leaked rollout dates, and they're sooner than most people expected. According to Samsung's internal schedule, Galaxy S25, S25 Plus, and S25 Ultra are first in line, September 18th, just a few days from now. A week later, the S25 Edge and the entire S24 lineup join in. S23 users, your wait ends on October 2nd, while older flagships like the S22 Ultra follow by October 6th. Foldable users will see Z Fold 6 and Flip 6 updates starting October 10, and even the Tab S10 series gets it fast, October 1st. If you own a Watch 7 6 or FE, your One UI 8 watch update drops the same day as the tablets, which is unusually quick for wearables. So in less than three weeks, almost the entire Galaxy ecosystem, phones, tablets, watches, will be running the same brand, new software at the same time. That's the closest Samsung has ever come to an Apple-style synchronized rollout, and it shows how serious they are about software in 2025. The real question now is what surprise feature Samsung will keep hidden until the stable build lands. Every big update usually ships with one or two unannounced tricks, and with Galaxy AI at the center of everything, we might see a huge jump in live translation, transcription, or even new generative AI wallpapers that are faster and better than before. Your turn. Which feature are you most excited about? Drop it in the comments, because the next two weeks are going to be wild. If you haven't already, update your Galaxy Store apps, Refresh those language packs and make sure auto download is enabled so you get One UI 8 the second it rolls out to your device. Thanks for watching all the way through. If you found this helpful, hit that like button before you go. Share this with someone waiting on the update and subscribe so you don't miss my full hands on with the stable release. Trust me, you're going to want to see that. Until then, stay tuned. The next notification you get might just be your update.